Welcome, Leahs. Okay, Leahs, let's go in and see what is coming out for you, Leahs. Um, this is the call to reading um, for the month of April, May, and June. Um, and I want to say thank you for being here. Thank you for being back. Welcome, newcomers. Um, I hope you will stay. All right, so stay optimistic. Your dreams are coming true. Don't quit before the miracle occurs, okay? So there is some sort of a problem issue. I see a lot of you are dealing with a cancer. This cancer could be your boss, supervisor, or someone on the work floor. They're now recognizing a whole lot of jealousy that was coming from a cancer and a Libra. Um, whatever is happening and transpiring, an Aquarius and a cancer, some sort of a problem issue that a lot of you are going to be having with an Aquarian and a Cancer in this timeline. A lot of you have been um, trying to stay optimistic, but it's as if you have a Cancer boss and a Libra colleague that is creating a whole lot of a problem for you and is now recognizing and is now seeing the truth of what was happening and transpired. There is a lot of jealousy. A lot of you, um, there is a lot of jealousy and um, the jealousy is uh, really creating a whole lot of issues so, um, for a lot of you. There is there is just uh, so much jealousy um, around you, Leo. So you, Leo's need to look out for a Pisces Cancer or Scorpion woman, whoever the Pisces Cancer or Scorpion woman is, you got to look out for who this person is. How does this person connect with you in your work life? Okay. Um, that is Cancer. What well, um, emotion? There's a lot of emotional situation around the work for whatever is happening, whatever is transpiring. A lot of people are having a lot of emotional situation when it comes at, um, um, towards the work floor that sort of a situation um, where there's emotion at a at, um, at, at real deep level. Remember to thumbs up. And if you want to see the extended of this reading, follow us to the other side when we're finished. Um, but for now, number 77 is going to be playing a, a role. And a lot of you Leos are going to be recognizing that something you have done in the past or some sort of a problem as, as if you're not on the right part. Because if you notice the sevens are in reverse, you're not on the right part, especially um, Leo men, you're not on the right part. Now there is some sort of a transition um, that is going to be coming up. And I see um, you young Leo ladies are turning your back to an older man. Whoever this man is, uh, um, whatever this man has created in your world, I see you young Leo ladies are turning your back to an Aries Leo or Sagittarian and uh, um, a Taurus Virgo or Capricorn. They're investigating this man and they're recognizing something about this man, whoever this man is. I see that the Aquarian, there is some sort of an investigation on uh, your boss. If your boss is a Taurus Virgo or Capricorn person, they are now investigating your boss. So a lot of you um, young ladies that have a boss that is a Taurus Virgo or a Capricorn person, they're definitely um, investigating your boss. A lot of you young people are thinking to make some sort of a change and you're looking for a better future. It's as if uh, you are going to be walking away from your boss, whoever this person is, uh, that is your boss. You're going to be walking away from your boss because you recognize um, that uh, moving forward with this person is not going to be relevant at this timeline because you recognize that this person, there is some sort of a undesirable play that this person have done and you're turning your back to this person because uh, you recognize that this man, whoever this man is, your boss, supervisor, I've gotten you in some sort of a problem and this person, they are investigating this person. So there was some sort of an unconventional situation that um, a Pisces, Cancer, a Scorpion woman together with a Taurus, Virgo, a Capricorn person have created for you, young Aries, Leo, or Sagittarian. And now they're investigating um, you young people, young people between the ages of 18 and 45. They're definitely... Um, 
investigating you young people because it's as if uh, you got caught up in some sort of a situation where your boss could have brought you in, in some sort of an unsayable situation that you got caught up with. Leo men, with a business or you're working, you're in some sort of a problem. Um, it's as if in the past you have gone through um, a whole lot of uh, um, undesirable play that is coming back uh, to affect you, Leo men, in this timeline. So people are now recognizing that you, Leo men, whether supervisors or business Leo men, you have some issues um, to deal with because people are now recognizing the unsavorable play that was created. So we're looking at a um, at May, uh, April, and the situation with April is that a lot of you Leo men and young Leo women or having some sort of an issue where um, it's as if you guys recognize that you have gotten caught up in some sort of a situation that is undesirable, some sort of an undesirable situation. And what is um, transpiring um, is that a lot of you are recognizing that you have uh, um, had some sort of an undesirable a situation where you could have gotten caught up in some sort of an undesirable situation, whatever you got caught up in is now creating some sort of an issue, some sort of a, um, problems in your world. And um, I see that, you know, it's as if uh, you, a Leo man, has no ground to stand on because people are now recognizing and seeing that you have uh, created some sort of a problem, an issue for other people, and it's all because of a jealousy. So young, so all the Leo men and young Leo women, I see, especially you young Leo women, are looking for a better start. You um, Leo men are looking back at the past and uh, you young Leo women are looking at the future and turning your back to some sort of an issue um, at the workplace and is looking for a new job. A lot of you young Leo women is looking for new status somewhere else or a new position somewhere else. So a lot of you um, men are have to be dealing with some sort of our problems and issues that was created in the past because they're recognizing and seeing the, the truth of what is happening and transpiring. So um, it is a situation where a whole lot of people is going to be understanding um, that uh, transition is going to be coming up. And I see they recognize that whoever this lady is, is affecting a lot of you Leo men and women. In the month of May, um, it's as if uh, the sand is uh, um, moving from underneath your foot. And a lot of you are trying to protect yourself from a Taurus bird or a Capricorn person. But it is as if uh, you Leo men, this person could be a business partner or for the rest of you, a supervisor. Whoever this person is, you're trying to protect yourself from this person um, in the month of May. Whatever this person have done, the seven of ones, they're recognizing um, what um, that a lot of you are having issues with the Taurus Virgo or Capricorn man. Okay, so this could be a business partner, a supervisor, or your boss that a lot of you are having um, some issues, some problems with um, that is recreating a lot of a situation. In the month of June, um, there is uh, um, some uh, serious, uh, serious um, complication with an Aquarian, whoever this Aquarian is. And whenever Aquarian comes up most of the time, um, it has to do with some sort of an investigation. Um, some sort of a problem issues on the work floor could be coming up where um, they could be investigating a Pisces cancer or a scorpion woman. If this woman is your supervisor, then all of you are going to be under investigation on the work floor. So be aware of this. So there is a really some sort of an issue that has been happening and transpiring. And a lot of you Leos... It is as if uh, the world or this year on the whole 
is um, spinning out of control. For a lot of you, Leos, is the, the whole world, the whole situation is just spinning and spinning out of control in some form and way. And the person who has created this problem for a lot of you is a Pisces, Cancer, a Scorpion. They're not showing up who this person is, um, how this person have done it, but they have an end in whatever is going on around you. And it's as if everything is spinning spinning out of control and people are now recognizing that this lady um and they're investigating this lady a whole they are going deep to find out how this lady got this position who is this lady because they're recognizing that this lady together with an Aries Leo or a Sagittarian man have created a whole lot of issues and a whole lot of problems. And they're recognizing um, that this lady has contributed to a lot of problems in you Leo um, lives. So, so who is this person? How does this person affect you? It's a Pisces Cancer or a Scorpion person. For some of you, there was a lot of jealousy that was coming uh, to you from this person. Um, and the energy that you're dealing with is really significant because um, a lot of you are dealing with another Aries Leo, a Sagittarian person on the work floor. Um, some of your Leo men were dealing with an Aquarian. There is some sort of a problem so on the work floor. They, um, and, it, you know, for you Leos, it is as if jealousy is uh, at play. And there is no um, strong foundation around you at the workplace or at your business. Absolutely no strong foundation. It's as if the sand is moving um, under your feet. So then there is a young Aquarian, Gemini or Libra person. They're going to be recognizing that a Pisces, Cancer, Scorpion person together with a young Aquarian a Libra and a general person and a Taurus Virgo or a Capricorn person, they're going to be recognizing that this could be a family business and you young Leos are going to be turning your back on these people in order to ac ac accelerate and uh, create a better start for you. So um, there is problems that is going to be coming up. There's a whole lot of problems. There's no question about this. There is definitely a whole lot of problems and whoever... Um, this man is and whatever is transpiring, whether it's an Aries Leo or a Sagittarian person, this person have created a lot of uh, inseparably on call for issues and have created a lot of problems for a lot of you Leos. And I see that they're going to be recognizing the foul play of what these people have created and how these people have uh, um create some sort of a instability around the work floor, um, the, the work process condition um, for a lot of you. And whoever the spicy Cancer or Scorpion person is, is that they're going to be recognizing um, that this person has created so much issues and it's all because of jealousy. All because of jealousy and they're going to be bringing back some sort of a stability and they're going to be um, looking at each and every person that has accomplished or was um, um, someone that was formalizing a lot of uh, unsavorable um, swear on the work floor um, so I see that this 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 timeline especially um, for Leo men um, and young Leo women between the ages of 18 and um, 40 is going to be having some serious complication in these three months, okay? Serious, serious complication. Um, the seven of ones is as if some of you Leos are protecting yourself from a Taurus, Virgo or a Capricorn person, whoever this person is. And I see people are now recognizing and seeing what, because an Aquarian, is, they are investigating a Pisces Cancer Scorpion. Is this your boss? Is this your supervisor? Who is this person? Because there is some sort of an investigation. Whatever this person have done and created 
and some of you were, they are investigating this person because they recognize that this person has gone a little bit too far. I would love to see you on the other side. If not, I am saying to you guys, namaste. I'm wishing you a good quarter because this um this quarter is going to be good for a lot of you. Um, however, you are um standing up. I see that this quarter is going to be making a lot of changes. If you want to see the extended, use the blue button join, use the second subscription, and I will see you there. Namaste until next time.